Hi all. Um, yeah, this is an update for September. Um, but first of all, um, sorry, let me get that on the screen. Uh, some sad news. Um, this is Mark Williams. Um, he was one of our uh, Kickstarter backers and um, sadly passed away a couple of months ago. Uh, I think I think it was May. Um, so this this is not exactly new news, but it's new to me. Now the reason I found out was the um, I was literally actually funny enough it's due to have the case case shipped, um, and Diane contacted me to to tell me he'd passed away. Um, so um, I'm doing a refund for the case. Makes no sense to send it, but uh, I just want to send my sympathies and condolences. Um, and anyone else in the group, you can see his comments uh, th throughout this uh, this group. So uh, it's quite sad. Um, I know the case is irrelevant to this. It doesn't make any difference. But I know he was kind of looking forward to getting the case. Um, so I mentioned it anyway. Um, but um, I wish to, uh, all my best to the family. Um, but there you go. So it's a sad loss. Um, and um, but I'm not quite sure what more you can say in these situations, but um, I do uh, on, on my best goes out to everyone, anyway. Let's move on. Okay, uh, yeah, so uh, I want to apologize for my slow communication. I know I've seen a message saying there's so many messages. I, I mean, I always do lots of messages, but. I've slowed down a little bit with these updates. Um, the main reason I'm building cases. <laughs> I've spent the month building cases. Um, um, and so, um, you know, it's uh, um, that's where we are. Now, I did say I was going to do um, a live stream. Kind of have to postpone it because the problem with doing a live stream is I could build 10 cases in the time I could build to the live stream. And, and I don't seem to have... I mean, you lot seem to be supporting each other, which is what I was hoping for. And as I said, I did the manual so that hopefully it won't be too many problems. Uh, and you guys have been helping each other, which is absolutely fantastic. And I, and I, I do appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, the reason for the slow, up, the slow updates. Um, numbers of cases that have been shipped. Uh, I just put out a post the other day. Um, as of this Monday, I'd shipped 183 cases. I'm uh, I'm now now I, I because I I'm actually up to now invoice 11:50. Now I've, I haven't shipped that yet. That's I think I've shipped up to uh, 11:35. I think. Now, bearing in mind some higher numbers have actually gone out as well, but they were Patreons, and I've already discussed this because my Patreon backers have helped out no end, so I've shipped theirs out quicker. And this thing about people sponsoring and helping to bring the plastics in, that kind of thing. Now, I'll come back to that. So I'm now, I literally, I packed up invoice 11.49 last night. Um, now, 11.49 doesn't, because a lot of cases, a lot of orders are like two cases. Um a handful of in three cases so the actual invoice number bears no relation to the number of cases but i have actually shipped 183 cases they have shipped 183 cases now i have a stack of 15 cases so i'm almost over the magic 200 um they are moving out quite well i'm averaging about i'd say i'm doing about 40 a week um maybe a bit more than 40 a week but you know i'm, I'm not doing too badly i'm, I'm kind of on target well, the new target, not the original target of a month, because, yeah, anyway, we all know about that. So, uh, I'm not running here. Um, uh, what a rubbish picture. <laughs> Actually, no, it's, no, it's a great picture, but you can see my Windows icons up the side. Uh, let's open up the browser. Um, go to the Facebook group. At least put something useful up there, shall we? Uh, come on 
this section has been pretty popular. Please post your pictures here. Um, if when you get your case and you take some pictures, could you put it? It's a pinned thread, so could you add your pictures on there? I also put a couple of these in other places, like on um, Commodore Amiga Facebook group and Amiga Computers Facebook group, a few others like. So you know, it'd be nice as you have these posted around. Uh, uh, yeah, lack of sleep. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm last night I finished it because well, as you know this is not my day job so I have to do my day job <clears throat> I tend to be doing working one day and then every other day I go in like 4 or 5 o'clock to the office and I build 10 to between 10 and 15 cases so um, I'm getting back about 12 1 o'clock at night <clears throat> so that's quite good fun uh, um, of course you know 7 month old baby as well it's interesting but he's got he's awesome so that doesn't matter uh, so it's a bit of lack of sleep. <clears throat> um, one question that gets asked a lot is, when can I order cases? Now, a lot of people, I mean, I've been saying this for ages, you cannot order cases until I've shipped all the backers. Okay? Um, now, so I'm going to get all the backers' cases out. I may even take a couple of weeks' break, and then I'll start ordering for the next batch. And I haven't decided on the f how I'm actually doing that. Um, I'll give you more information about that soon. But so far, we've gone past 100 on the waiting list. Um, the waiting list is just email me, steve at imika.net. I'll just drop it. People don't leave a message on the Facebook group, say, I want one. You ain't, it's not happening that way. Email it to me, I'll drop it into a folder. And then all the email addresses in that folder will get updated now. Uh, the idea being is you jump on it first, you get the lower invoice number, yeah? So you get it quicker. Um, don't expect them instantly because I have to make another batch. Um, so again, I'm trying to decide the best way of doing this, whether I do how the payments, considering doing it as another um, Kickstarter, because I've got six potentially 600 cases I can make. Um, but I'm going to tell you about that later. Um, the Okay, let's talk about the ACA 500 Plus situation. As you know, um, I've, one of the things I did, I promoted the individual ACA 500 plus board uh, and said that the, it was about, well, basically, because I had one and, <clears throat> and um, Rob had one and it worked brilliantly. You know, we say put it in the case, absolutely works brilliantly. But what we found was that um, some people out there were having problems, they were putting theirs in, it wasn't working, or it was. Uh, I don't want to sound reliable, it just, just wasn't working. Now, um, obviously, we've been in contact with Jen's individual, uh, and we've supplied he's got He's got one of our boards. He's got, I've sent him one of the cases. Um, so he's got everything he needs, and we're waiting to see what he comes back with. Now, to be clear, the, the ACA 500 Plus is designed to plug into the 500. Externally, does say this. Um, and ours is obviously an extension board, which is longer. Um, and so it's obviously, um, it's causing, I don't really care if I say this, but it, it, the, the, the extra distance is causing problems for the board, which has made it um, not function as well as if it was plugged into the side. So we're trying to find out what that is. Now, it seems to be, if you're buying a recent board, um, now a lot of people come back to said, I mean, my one's two years old, was fine. So um, it seems to be if you've got, like, put one in the last year or you're buying a new one, then um, there may be problems. My At the moment, what I would say is if you're thinking of buying a new one for the case, for now, don't. Um, there are plenty of other ways of doing this. Uh, there are plenty of ways you can get uh, one of the... Uh, Stephen Leary's board's been made that goes into the 68k socket with com with IDE or compact flash on it. Personally, I'd I'd you I'd buy that instead for now. Um, the AC500 Plus obviously does offer extra, lots of other bits potential, which is one of the reasons I promoted it and said. But if we are going to have, um, you know, I'm, I'm not blaming the card. It's very important to understand that. But obviously, because we're extending it up there seems to be it's causing some problems for the card um which is not designed to expect so um 
if you're thinking of buying a board for an ACA 500 plus board at the moment, don't buy something else. Buy um, there are plenty of other boards that go into the 68. There's lots coming along, um, and they go straight into C, the uh, 68K socket. Um, and they're and they're quite economical as well. I mean, to be honest, I think we need some RAM. Um, I mean, for the same price, you could probably get. Uh, and I, I've seen them on um, Amy Bay. I think you can get them for around 130 pounds with an ID interface and uh, like a 25 megahertz, so 30 and say 8 mega RAM, 16 mega RAM, something like for for the same kind of price. And what you've got then is a really nice little board. So I would buy that, put it in, um, because then you've still got the Zorro slot you could use, or or in, you know you you know I, I know I know of people bought Zorro. I think the Zorro board is a brilliant thing to buy. Um, so, um, but it's you know we've just kind of been caught up. Oh, i've been caught my pants down i tested it worked well had one tested it it worked um now are, are you probably aware of this because pixel vixen vicky um she she did the the live unboxing and build and it didn't work which is really disappointing um and i've been in touch with her and i've actually what i've done is i've sent her mine and I and and, she, and I said if she, and she can swap and she's actually going to swap and give me her one that doesn't work. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get that board and I'm going to send it to Rob. And then Rob's going to do some tests as well. So individual computing are doing some tests and to see if there's anything they can do to help. Um, and we're going to do the same thing um, and see if there's something that we can do. Um, but in the meantime, and for you, for now, don't buy one. Don't buy one of those. Don't, don't buy one of them. Um, if you're going to use it for my case, if you're going to buy it for just five hundred, Christ, yeah, it's a fantastic card. Um, but not, for for time being, not a new one. Unless if it's an old one, um, then you know I would I'm a couple of years old. I think you'd be right. I mean, everyone seems to be saying the response I'm getting is it's a couple of years old. It's okay. Um, it just seems to be there. the new one. Apparently, has got a different chip on it and. So, um, but I haven't got it yet, so we've got no, we, we, we're, we're not sure what we're doing yet. But once I get it, and then, uh, you know, I hope to update this and say that everything's fine now and heck, this is how, you know, get it to work. Um, but I'd take responsibility for this because although it worked with ours, you know, these things do change. And it is a complex board. And so I think his timings are obviously, it's important, the timing. So, um, but anyway, so, uh, yeah, that's that. Uh, There's not really much else to say um uh all you guys at swag have a great time i think it's this saturday have a great time um sorry i can't be there but um i'm going to be building cases <laughs> um this i'm taking this sunday off i'm going out enduro riding so hopefully i don't get injured <laughs> by gary we mate um but that's it really uh now let's show you some of these pictures shall we um let's we got loads of pictures in here see look at these look, look, look. look at that how cool is that <laughs> these are all of my groups you can see they've got everyone seems to be very pleased i mean the response has been fantastic and i'm and, and i am really i really do appreciate that lots of nice things being said so there's kendrick's as i said if you've got one that's a nice one look at that <laughs> um there's another one. Oh, you've got the white button there but, uh, but lot, yeah i couldn't do anything about it. people said why don't you do the button i can't because there's so many different types of amiga floppy button there's no way i can do it i think spraying is the best thing to spray a black oh that's not oh that's my one i took a picture of mine in the dark because uh it looks really cool with the red lights uh yeah, did he put any more pictures? This is Erwin. Erwin was really um, good lad because, oh, is there anything in there? There you go, that is his. Erwin w uh, was the guy who translated the German manual for me. Um, here's another one. See, lots of people. Look at that. How about that? Look, that's, <laughs> that's some serious. Oh, wow, he's got vampire stickers all over it. Mm. <laughs> I love the vampire. I've got one in my own, but the yeah okay uh <laughs> what about this one look at that that's a bit dark isn't it yeah so 
See, that one's quite nice. He's got the same colour monitor. Did he spray that monitor? I'm not sure, but it looks quite nice, doesn't it? <laughs> Another one. People are having a lot of fun with this. It's it's really nice, actually, because it's really gratifying to do all this work, and then, um, and then people really like it. So I'm... Um, that's nearly as messy as mine. <laughs> yeah. So uh, here's another one. Slightly small monitor. I could do a bigger monitor. Look at these. Wow. <laughs> now, funny enough, you see, you'd think you'd want black keys, but actually, it doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad at all, actually, in the white keys. Uh, oh, what's this one? Oh, he's made a custom, got a custom keyboard done there. <laughs> Another white um, disc, no, floppy bell. There you go. So yeah, 183 shipped. Um, so yeah, progress has been made. Um, I, I will try and sort out a uh, live stream. As I said, no one's actually, I don't get that many questions. I get the odd question, but you lot have been really good and support each other. And as I said, if I spend time doing a live stream in the evening, right, that's the evening gone, I could have been making cases and I can make 10 to 15 cases in that period. Well, you know, if I'm going in the evening. So um, that means 10 to 15 people are delayed. So I'm trying, I'm kind of postponing these streams for that reason anyway um i am gonna have a video coming up uh it's called um a dozen things i dislike about the checkmate 1500 um it's it's not a. it's a basically me flaming my own product um a little thing it's more to really to explain why things certain things are the way they are um because you go oh that's rubbish man there's reasons for it so expect that to be coming soon um, but thanks for your continued support. I really appreciate it. Um, and if you want to mention uh, anything on Mark Williams' page or send a message or post here, I mean, um, I'll um, on the, you can post underneath this on the on the group. I mean, I'll leave it up to you how to do it. But um, I'm sure his uh, his wife and family would appreciate it. Okay, so. Uh, Thanks very much, and um, I will speak to you soon.